Guys, Tony the Soy Sass Assassin. Welcome to another episode of Cigar Review. And today we are doing this cigars I cannot pronounce. Shut up, Rick. Shut up. And uh, this is gonna be the Mattel Serena Maduro, and I believe a Robusto size. Robusto size. This is not Toro. Too small for Toro. Is their Toro six and a half inch? This is not Toro. This is a Robusto. This uh, cigar came from Midnight Smoke. Well, Midnight Cigar. Yeah. Midnight Cigar. Eric. Why do I keep saying Midnight Smoke? Because I'm smoking Midnight? No. Midnight Cigar. Midnight Cigar, Eric. And um, he sent me this a while back. I, I just didn't get to it until today. Because I was like, I want to smoke something safe. And what's safer than San Andreas? Right? So, yeah. This is... Uh, Good cigar, let's take a quick look. Okay, today we have Mattel, Serena, Maduro, Robusto. Five and a quarter by 50, MSRP $8.50. Come in the box of 20, so $170. Wrapper is Mexican San Andreas, as you can see, kind of ugly. Binder is Dominican, Criollo 98. Filler is Dominican and Nicaraguan mix. There is a little bit of blemish on it. To give it the best chance, we will glue that up and get smoking. Okay. So now with the little blemish glued up and everything, let's get started because I, I just need to get this through quickly, I think. I have things to do. It's 9.50. Get things done, right? I think I already smoked uh, one of the Matilde. I call it Matilde. 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 Uh, cigar before. I think it was a purple band. This is the green band. Let's see if this is better. There is not much smell other than cedar. And that's for my cedar tray, I'm pretty sure. Oh. Can the cap want to come off? Oh, this cap want to come off. This cap want to come off. I didn't cut that much. Uh, I think that will do. Not too bad. Just a piece. Does it come off? No. All right. Damp. Raisiny woodsiness. That's what I can taste. Damp. Raisiny woodsiness. For fast action. We will let ooh. We'll let up with the torch. Smell like firewood just now. That's why I was like, ooh. It's a nice smell for char. It's salty, it's earthy, it 
is floral. The retro hair has a little bit of like earthy barnyard ammonia smell to it. Just a little bit. Smoke output is great. The dry is okay. The salt taste is good. The salt woodsiness is good, but like it's lacking something. Just that retro hill. At the end of retro hill, it kind of smells a little bit of ammonia. Ooh, that ammonia is strong if you if you retro your hair slowly. I thought I kind of smell chocolate, but I don't. I guess I smell ammonia. How do you mix up ammonia with chocolate? I don't know. I don't know. But, you know, we'll get to it. Smoke one third. Be right back. All right, one third. One third. The flavor. Ammonia is pretty much gone. It's kind of woodsy. Kind of nutty. There is a note that's similar to chocolate, but not really. Um, it really doesn't stand out at all. Uh, I just smell it once in a while. And um, there's a lot of mineral. Earthiness. Maybe a little bit leather. And a little bit sharpness to this. Like a citrus. No, but not really. It's on the nose too. And that's what we got. Mm, I don't know if I like it or I don't like it. But so far, okay. So far, okay. About medium strength right now. I want to say it makes me want to give it a chance. But like... It's like, I have no hope on you. But I'll give you a chance. Kind of thing, you know? So... Yeah, that's one third. Not much to it. Let's get right into second third. Wouldn't be too much. I think it's, it's only one, two. Yeah, about two and a half fingers. We'll be right back. All right, second third. It's obviously close to last third, but second third. Start to have a little bit of coffee, chocolate. Woodsy. It's a little bit of sweetness. Um, it's actually pretty good. Like right now, I can taste that mixture coffee you know uh the the woodsiness the dankiness all that stuff that 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 say i just brought bring you but it's actually kind of mellow it's kind of mellow it's got a little bit saltiness to it too which i like so right now this part is really good second third once you get to a certain point pretty good i like that tastes good all right second third very good so now we're in the last third if it stays away with the cigar. If it doesn't, yeah. Again, I'm gonna give it a chance, you know. I'm hoping it does 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 do good. It's not a very expensive cigar. And if it tastes good, why not, right? So but let's look at oh my gosh, how much glue you put on this thing. Alright. The main band, like I say, we did the purple one before, this time it's green. Look nice. Kind of serene, calm, forest like. And the second band just say Serena Maduro. Serena Maduro. Serena, Serena, Serena. Ah. Tomato, tomato. Blah, blah. There you go. Not a bad band. Just they put a lot of glue on that thing. Like you, you, like you can actually see like the glue chunks. That's how much glue that's on there. Yeah. But, hey, here's another side. There you go. See that? So much glue, man. Anyway, Laster. Be right back. All right. So, Laster, the flavor kind of died down a little bit. It has a little bit of, uh, what is that taste called? A light flavored cleaner taste. Yeah, like a bathroom cleaner of some sort. I don't know. I can't tell what that is. Yeah, 
just basically the flavor and then dies down and then sometimes has that clean cleaning agent taste i don't know i can't tell what that is so overall the cigar is pretty good i think it's enjoyable especially from the second third on um that flavor combination is what i like but it's pretty basic right you know it's the san andreas and the dominican and nicaraguan combo which is good at the same time it's a more of a mellow kind of flavor mellow kind of flavor so it's not bad i i actually like it uh, you know for a standard cigar it's not bad at all in terms of price i think i'll pay i don't know nine dollar ten dollar for this not bad it's, it's not towards the higher end i think that's to a basic cigar like just a higher basic cigar that i can enjoy tastes pretty good 10 bucks not not big deal kind of cigar so yeah i mean it's it, it it's an it's a good normal cigar good normal cigar with the san andreas flavor you know the typical dominican nicaraguan combo give you that nice a little bit of nuttiness a little bit of coffee slash chocolate just very tiny little bit amount you still get a little bit of uh earthiness at time you do smell that barnyard but it's not very strong because the whole thing was mellow uh the body is about just under median and then you get that musty uh dankiness woodsiness from the san andreas yeah and a little bit sweetness there is citrus some here and there uh that sometimes brings in some sweetness but it's not the whole time. It's not all the time. Overall, good cigar. I like it. But it's to a normal range. If that means anything. Okay? So, that will be it for this cigar review. I hope you like it. If you like it, make sure you like, subscribe, comment, share. Check out podcast. Check out membership. Check out swag. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys. <laughs>